it's Marissa and Shauna and today's video is going to be seven things I wish I bought sooner so these are a little bit of everything we got you know fashion beauty you know food a little bit of everything so these are some things where maybe when we first got them we were like oh yeah we weren't that sure about them but now it's like oh my god what took us so long to get these things and there's like everything from clothes food health beauty all that good stuff and some of these things were things we bought and then some of them were just products that were gifted to us or like we're in pr or stuff so yeah so first we have these teddy blake bags and we have definitely talked about teddy blake on our channel before and they are these real leather bags made in italy so their designers are from well-known Italian design houses and they now design bags for a more affordable price point. Oh yeah, and these just feel so good. I can't stop smelling them because I love like the smell of leather bags. Like when you go into a store, oh, these are just so delightful. Like if you told me to hold this, I would be like, oh, that's like a $2,000 bag. Yeah. <laughs> And they have all the characteristics of like a really high-end luxury designer brand, you know, like Gucci, Versace, Prada, Dolce & Gabbana, Armani, Valentino. Oh yeah, just really high quality leather, really good construction, craftsmanship, just attention to detail. When you look at the bags, you see the threading and it's all perfect. And just, I love the designs too. And especially this pink color. Oh, I can't get over the color. Oh. But all without the one to $2,000 markup that those other brands have. Oh yeah, it's like you're really just paying for the name. You're paying for the label. Like this is just as good of quality as Gucci. I've gone to Gucci, I've felt Gucci, I've gone to Valentino, I've gone to Armani. Like I've gone to all these boutiques and felt the back and this is like just as good if not better. I think yeah. better because you're not paying, you're paying a couple hundred dollars instead of a couple thousand dollars for something that's like better quality in my opinion. Oh yeah, and both Marissa and I, we watch a lot of like luxury YouTubers and they're constantly complaining about the yeah. quality issues in these high-end brands. I feel like more contemporary labels are just like killing it right now. Like yeah. they're just doing such great quality that it's kind of like, why would you spend thousands of dollars more to get a bag that might have quality issues when yeah. you can get something that's like just as amazing oh, totally. for just like a few hundred dollars. Yeah, and I feel like you're just gonna have these bags for a really long time. They're just good investment bags. And instead of just getting one like really high end, like Louis Vuitton, like you can get this that's just as good a quality, but you can get many of them. <laughs> I love the color of your bag, by I the way. Know. And I love how structured yours is and like oh, the yeah. little clasps. It's very like businessy. And then mine's like, ooh, like a fun like date or like a, like a, like a beach day. Oh, mine is the Kim bag. Um, Marissa's is the Vanessa bag, and they're both in 14 inches. So we are gonna have Teddy Blake linked below for you guys if you want to check them out. And we will also have a coupon code so you guys can get $30 off your purchase, anything but sale items. Oh yeah, the coupon code is TB Marissa and Shauna 30. So we'll have it right here. Yeah. So yeah, definitely check them out. The designs are just so cute. I want even more. <laughs> Me too. And I know Sean is jealous of my bag and I'm jealous of her bag. Well, oh, your bag is a really beautiful color. I like the Yeah, bag. and it's I love so how really. you can just throw stuff in it so big. And your bag is quite big too, which I like. Yeah, I like how structured it is. I know. So next thing on our list of things that we wish we bought earlier are these um, jackets from Amazon. But what's so cool about them is that the material is SPF 50. Yeah, SPF 50. And so these were only $23, but they are such a great investment because you wear it when it's super sunny and then you don't have to like slather your arms with like sticky, greasy mm. sunblock. I mean, granted, you do still have to put it on the back of your neck, obviously your face, the back hands. of your hands, things like that, but like your arms and like if you zip it up, like your chest and your kind of back area, like, oh, 
And especially if you're wearing like a tank top or something, like this is amazing. I will also say I was worried about being too hot in this because mm -hmm. I'm like, nobody wants to wear long sleeves in the middle of summer, but this is very lightweight. Like yeah. something about this material, it's kind of like cooling. Like it's like a cooling yeah. material. Like it doesn't, I was not hot at all in this. And I was very surprised at that because I was expecting yeah. to be hot. We actually bought these um, to wear to Disneyland because you know it's so hot and sunny all day. You're walking around. Oh yeah, no, I, I kind of want to get like pants, like SPF pants. Yeah, <laughs> they sell them. I wonder if they have SPF shoes too. Ooh, I, I love. I just love SPF things because like I'm fine to wear sunblock. Obviously on your face, there's not much you can do about it unless you want to get one of those face shields yeah. and look like a stormtrooper from Star Wars, but. You know, I feel like for for body, it's just it's just such a pain to constantly reapply sunblock yeah. everywhere. So I feel like these are good if you're going to a theme park, a water park, swimming, a regular park, whatever, any kind of park. Okay, so next up are some rugs that we got from Rugs USA. And in our house, we originally didn't want any rugs because we were yeah. kind of like, it makes it look more cluttered, it makes it look more messy. But now that we have rugs, I'm like, oh my god, why didn't I get this I sooner? Know. Now that we have the rugs, I really can't picture not having the rugs, to yeah. be honest. Our cat loves them too. Oh my god, he like rolls around on them. If we put like catnip on some of his toys and put the toys on the carpet. He like, he just lays there where the toys have been and stuff. And Rugs USA was a great choice because they have so many options, like literally yeah. thousands. I was on the site for like hours trying to choose between all yeah. the different designs. So we eventually oh, yeah. went with these kind of like Moroccan style yeah. rugs. Yeah, I really like them. I feel like they're just like, they kind of make the floor look more fancy. Yeah. <laughs> They're kind of like add a bohemian touch yeah. to our house, which I really like. Oh, and I really recommend getting rug pads for underneath so that they don't slip and slide. I feel like this, especially if you're putting it on a hardwood floor, like if you're putting it on carpet, like carpet on carpet, it's probably fine. You don't need a rug pad. But if you're putting it on the floor, definitely, definitely get a rug pad so you're not <laughs> slipping and sliding everywhere. Like it is such a good investment you will be very thankful. So next is a brand that we have right here, but we're also both wearing, <laughs> and it is Mono B. And these are sports bras, and then I also have a pair of shorts, and then I know Shauna also has sports Well, I'm shorts. actually not wearing it right now, but uh, I mean. Well, I am. You are. <laughs> I, I am. Mine, like last night to sleep in. They're so Oh my gosh, I love Mono B. I feel like our, it's funny because we call this brand Better than set active, because we just love, like I feel like their pieces are so much more comfortable than set active pieces. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, it's an athleisure brand, so you're meant to wear them, you know, while you're working out, but also you can wear them like around the house. Like, yeah. like I said, like I wore mine to bed and it was just really comfortable. Oh, I wear these all day, every day. This is like my every day, everywhere, everything bra. I cannot imagine like, not wearing this <laughs> bra, these bras. Like I, and I really like the brand too. I just feel like it's very comfortable. Um, and it's, I feel like for me, it's high support. Mm. Cause like when you have bigger boobs, like you can't really wear little bralettes. Like, I don't know, yeah. it just, it doesn't really work for you. You need something a little more like durable. Supportive. Yeah, supportive, a, a little more like heavy duty, I'll say. Um, especially if you are like going to work out, like that little flimsy Calvin Klein is not gonna do it for me, sis. We need a little, we need something a little more like fitnessy. Okay, so next we have this mermaid poster from Diamond Art Club. Ooh, yeah, this is so cool. <laughs> this is so cool. It's it's very similar to Paint by Numbers, except with crystals instead of paint. And Marissa has been doing yeah. so much work on it. We both have. It's funny because Shauna like started it and spent a long time doing it because it does take a long time to do like each crystal. But then like I kind of got into it and now it's kind of like my, when I'm watching kind of like a background show on TV, like I'll just get really into it. And then I'll look at the clock and like, two, three hours will have gone by and yeah. I'll have gone through like all these crystals and I'll have, it'll look like I only did like that much, but I know that like that much took me like two hours, but I just really like it. I think it really reminds me of like adult coloring books. Yeah, a bit. it does. Just in a sense that you're doing something that's very like 
kind of repetitive, um, but like it, it's supposed to be soothing and like you're just yeah. kind of following the colors and you're kind of slowly building. I, I guess I would also classify it as kind of like doing a puzzle. Yeah. Yeah. It's quite relaxing. Yeah. Yeah. Like you said, good to do while you're, you know, watching a show in the background. Yeah. Like listening to music. Like it's definitely kind of like a multitask sort of thing. Like mm -hmm. you've been listening to a podcast, a TV show, movie, whatever. But I feel like it's just really cool. And I'm excited to see it when it's done. It's not yeah. going to be done for a while. Oh, yeah. This uh, might take us a while. Probably like a year. <laughs> I mean, this is one of their biggest size posters. Yeah. So we kind of are tackling one of the harder we, ones. We bit off a lot. <laughs> So next we have these sandals from Franco Sardo, another Italian brand Ooh. in the mix. And I just really like these sandals. I feel like they're really cute for summer. They're very cozy and like they're just really easy to put on and slip on. And I really love sandals like that. Like I hate sandals where it's like you have to clip it in and it's really oh, annoying. Yeah, same. <laughs> Both of us like only wear clip on or uh, slide in yeah. sandals. We don't like the ones where you have to clip yeah. on. Especially if you're going to like the beach or something, like you just want to Easily. Take on, take off like sandals. Oh, yeah. I don't want to do something really complicated or like, I don't know. So I just love these like cute slip ons. You can just slip them on and go. <laughs> but these feel like really good quality. They feel yeah. like really nice, high quality Italian leather. I've just been oh, really yeah. impressed with them. I mean, I feel like they feel more high end than the price would indicate. Yeah, and I feel like they're gonna last a really long time. Like they're gonna like hold up really well. Um, I feel like we've both been kind of trying to invest more in high quality sandals rather than like the cheap flimsy like dollar store ones that always break. Yeah. Cause those just like, I've had way too many experiences where I'm out by the beach and they break on me and I'm freaking oh, yeah. out. So I just love like more durable high end sandals like these. So finally are some, I feel like these are crinkling, are some products from dun, 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 Public Goods. And I feel like we got a lot of like snacks and things, which I really, really love. Um, yesterday we made the mac and cheese and oh, it was yeah. so good. I put like crumbled hot Cheetos on it too. Mm -hmm. It was so delicious, but like, I was like, for box mac and cheese, this is really I good. Know. Like, I'm addicted to this. And then the snacks, oh my god, I busted these open like the second I got these. These are the banana chips, spicy buffalo, and garlic and herb. These are just really tasty, really flavorful. Oh yeah, we've already finished the cookies. Oh, <laughs> the oatmeal cookies, those did not last long. Those were like so Moorish. Like, I just kept eating them. <laughs> and this is not a snack for, you know, for us. <laughs> for us. This is catnip and our cat sushi loves it. Oh yeah. Oh, and then I also got some pecans, sweet and spicy and candied. Mm. And I like to like nibble on these or put them on salads or something. And those were both like super delicious. Um, and then we got chips and salsa too that we've been munching on. And then I guess the only thing I have not tried yet is the ramen, but it comes in a five pack and it looks really good. And yeah, so definitely looking forward to trying out more like grocery items from Public Goods. I feel like I was pleased with everything we got. Yeah. But yeah, I feel like uh, the banana chips were my favorite thing because mm. it was like eating a potato chip, but like a little healthier because it's a banana. I like the mac and cheese. Oh, the mac and cheese was really good, but also the catnip, okay. <laughs> catnip for sushi. <laughs> So we will have everything linked down below and the Teddy Blake bags, remember to use our code. We'll have it here on the screen and also linked down below. Yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching the seven products we wish we bought earlier. I feel like all of these things I'm like, man, I want more of these. <laughs> Cause like everything in the video is just so like perfect for us and I wish we'd gotten it sooner. And we love you guys. Okay. Big kiss and bye. bye.